About 250,000 residents of Lagos have been targeted for free medical treatment through the Jigibola Healthcare Initiative. Speaking at the flag off of the fourth edition of Bosco Free Medical Outreach Tagged, Jigibola Relaunch Phase 2, Governor Sonwolu maintained that his administration is more concerned about the health of the people and would ensure quality health care is delivered. Plus, the news correspondent, Love Ikukoye Dokun, has more in this report. <laughs> The relaunch of the Jigibola Initiative is in conjunction with the Babajide Sawunlu and Kadri Obafemi Hamzad Health Mission International, Bosco. The Jigibola Health Mission was launched during the administration of Ashiwaju Bola Tinubu as a free sight and hearing aid program of the Lagos State Government in 2001. The program targeted to reach over 250,000 Lagosians had no fewer than 961 volunteers providing medical services for the outreach. In this fourth edition, this mission has made enough provision to carry out routine screening exercises on the residents across the 20 local government areas and 37 LCDA of the state. And if you listen attentively to what the conveyor was saying, Mrs. Nikkei Osai, she actually mentioned the fact that this will be taking place in different areas of the state, which she mentioned, Shomolu, Amuwa Odofi, Etiosa, Ibejuleki, Koshofe, Mushi, Surulero, and so on and so forth. Governor Sawunlu is represented here. He discloses that through Bosco Health Mission International, his administration has continued to lead the frontiers in delivering good health care services for the citizens. This administration has also taken the bolder step by broadening the scope of this health mission to include other health provisions beyond the provision of visual and hearing aids to cater for the need of Lagosians whose health need do not fall within visual and hearing impairment alone. And we must not apologize or be apologetic for the growing number of cases, but we must take deliberate actions in reducing the statistics of hearing disabilities and lack of good vision. Similarly, the wife of the governor, Dr. Ibijuke Sawunlu, believes the program has contributed a great deal in achieving unparalleled impact in preventing major health risk among residents of the state. To urge the good people, it's especially those suffering from visual impairment, to take advantage of the initiative to improve their health. This is because a large number of cases of visual impairment could have been prevented if they were detected and treated. She also commends volunteers and partners who have decided to work with the state government to ensure the success of the initiative. From Lagos, Love Ikuku Uyedoku, Plus TV News. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.